right, we're here to take a look at this wonderful ukulele. Uh, this is a collaboration with Lana Frey. Uh, she's on Instagram, the Lana Frey Gallery, uh, and she is from Prague. The moment I found her on Instagram, I was a fan. Um, I see her work as painting the electric portrait, uh, not the physical light reflection, uh, but the electric energy a person has. So on this one, I took the opportunity to do something new. And let's see if I can find a good example, of, like right here. So here we see the image. I've actually layered the image in three times, printing them at different sizes and finding ways to cut them together. Sometimes pulling the images apart so it's really clear there are multiple, and sometimes putting them in really discreetly so you don't realize you're actually looking at three overlaid images. Your eyes first allow it to put together as one, and then they start looking like, wait a second, there are too many eyes in that piece. Uh, all editing I do on these is manual analog editing, either scissors uh, or exacto knife. Actually, I use a box knife. I find it handles better in my hand. Oh, one other different technique in this one I did, and I actually discovered it on this one. I think I've done it accidentally a few times, but her colors are usually pretty vibrant. I notice somehow I'm getting this richer, deeper tone in here, uh, and then I realize where I'm getting that from. So to make the edge of an image not look like it's been cut, often I will burn the sides of the image with a flame, a quick lighter burn. Sometimes I'll let just barely fray it to give a little fractal design to a, a straight edge. And other times I'll let the actual paper burn in and let the flame find the final edit. Well, I notice if I don't clean my hands before I glue the image down, the soot from my hands where I put the flame out on the paper actually transfers into the clear gluing that I'm putting it down with. And it creates, actually it just deepened up the tones. And I was pretty happy with that. Uh, although it was an accident on this one, I'm probably gonna continue that. Oh, and the canvas for this piece of work is a Kayla ukulele. This is a standard size ukulele, concert size ukulele. The 17 and a half inch uh, fret length, uh, the normal size ukulele that we all think about when we think ukulele. And it's been a long time since I've gone through my ukulele chords. Uh, so I apologize. Next time before I do one of these, I'll brush up on those. All right. Thank you very much. And thank you, Lana, for this collaboration. I had a great time working with your material. Thank you.